Hey, Swedish therapist here. Hey, we have sequence 13A for chlorine. So this is the explanation to um, our music from Annie, the musical, tomorrow. And um, the, the name instead of feel more is pay attention. So feeling more and paying attention to are similar. So I say pay attention to the small things because this sequence is all about small things. And let's see, let me show you something on me. This is a pelvis. So just like Mr. Sands here, he's, he doesn't have any um, arms or legs, Mr. Sands. These legs are attached right there. So when we do this sequence, we're going to be moving the legs, these long limbs, in and out. And when we do this, we're going to get this motion. And this is the smallest thing ever. And this is the bottom part of your spine on the back. But it's slow and it's easy and it's a rhythm. So find your own rhythm on this. Rhythms are really cool. Just like breathing is a rhythm. So, we have a great explanation on the internet. Who would have thought? Social dilemma. We have the internet. Wow. And it's on YouTube. Thank you, YouTube. So, this uh, behind me, you can see the autonomic nervous system. And um, the spine there. Oops there. So the middle part of the spine from there to there, I'm going to not have this absolutely correct, is called the sympathetic nervous system. It's the one that gets you going. So if you're driving in the car and, and the ambulance lights come behind you uh, and, and you uh, get alert, that's your sympathetic nervous system. It was always police lights for me. So then the parasympathetic up here, ooh, this is so hard to do. Up here in the neck and down here on the pelvis. So the parasympathetic is the rest and digest. So it starts in the lower lumbars. It starts in the lumbars and it's going to be helping the stomach and the intestines get that motion that a peristalsis that it absolutely needs because if if we have no peristalsis in this area we're gonna feel dolig we're gonna feel bad so let's get things moving and we will take deep breaths we'll do it fun and i'm just going to show you the uh youtube video from andrew huberman at stanford university because uh his for chlorine is exquisite. So. so let me share this with you guys. This is um, The Science of Stress, Calm, and Sleep with Andrew Huberman. He uh, is from Stan Stanford University and um, this is a fantastic webinar regarding how important it is to breathe. Now, we take for granted breathing because we've done it ever since we came out of our mom. But having a long exhale does an awful lot for calming the um, sympathetic nervous system and bringing up the parasympathetic nervous system. So if we're feeling stressed, one thing that would be really nice is to take a long exhale. And that can help an awful lot for having us to feel a little bit more calm and well-being. So feel free to go on YouTube and listen to Andrew Huberman. Uh, this is a fantastic exquisite for chlorine about how the diaphragm moves and what it is about the sympathetic and parasympathetic nervous system. Again, as I said, this is all about small things. So Maybe some of us know the smallest things out there can get the whole planet to pay attention. Yeah. 
So the whole planet has paid attention because of this very small thing. Everything changes. But we want for us progress on our health. Progress so that we feel good, so our family feels good. So why don't you come with me and let's, let me talk you through the sequence so that we can do it together and then you can put it to music and, and listen to it. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to change the view a little bit so you can see me better. So when you're doing this, take your Gumi Bond and set it over. Uh, so I did that even wrong. So take your Gumi Bond as long as you can. Have it. There you go. And then fold it. Make sure you don't have that. Make sure it's nice and flat. Good. Fold that over and fold that over. Good. Now you have it this way. Lay down. All right. So you can see me and you can see my legs. Good. So this is what we're going to do. Make sure that your elbows are on the ground. Still can't see that silly thing. That's there you go. There you go there then. Elbows on the ground. So make sure the elbows stay here. The more you pull, the more resistance is on the knees. So with this, slowly come out and then relax. Slowly come out and relax. Now you have to look at the screen for a while to get this. But the lower back should feel a little bit of movement. And I, I desperately hope it's not painful. But you can do this on your bed at night before you go to sleep. And this is small. You can see my feet aren't really moving. I don't want to be there. That's not the point. My feet are grounded to the earth and my knees come out against a little bit of resistance. If you feel your hands slipping, reset them down, elbows on the ground. Pull, and then easy, open and close. So, when we're doing this together with the forklaring, it's one thing. When the music is there, you can't hear me breathe you can see me breathe, but take your time with this. This is not a contest. That they're ing and toggling. Practice long exhales and take your time. Now, actually, we are done. And if you only choose to do just that without the music, you've done a good thing for your body. Taxa Hemsmake for Swedish Therapeut. I hope you have a good day.